सेवेंथ प्रॉब्लम एवेल्युएट इंटेग्रल वन बाय ए साइन एक्स प्लस बी कॉस एक्स डी एक्स सो नाउ i is equal to integral 1 by a sin x plus b cos x dx. So, now a sin x plus b cos x is there. This a sin x plus b cos x let us write in terms of sin function or cos function. So, then 1 by cos is for example, is there we get secant x easily we can integrate it. If you get 1 by sin, we get cosecant x easily we can integrate it. Let us try. So, let this a is equal to r cos theta and b is equal to r sin theta, where a square plus b square is equal to we get r square that implies r is equal to root of a square plus b square. That is nothing but elimination of theta from these two equations we get this one. So, this is equal to integral 1 by r cos theta sin x plus r sin theta cos x dx. Next, so r common that means indirectly we get 1 by r common integral of 1 by sin x cos theta plus cos x sin theta. dx sin x cos theta plus cos x sin theta is in the form of sin a cos b plus cos a sin b that is nothing but sin of a plus b. So, 1 by r integral 1 by sin of x plus theta dx this is 1 by r integral of cosecant of x plus theta dx. Integral of cosecant x already we have discussed. Integral of cosecant x dx is log of mod tan x by 2. So, this we can write 1 by r log mod tan of x plus x by 2 theta by 2. Let us replace r and theta values in terms of a b. See already r value is equal to root over a square plus b square whereas theta from these two we have to find out. So, theta means you see divide by r sin theta by r cos theta we get p by a this this gets cancelled tan theta is equal to b by a. What is theta? Tan inverse b by a. So, now this is equal to 1 by root of a square plus b square log mod tan of x by 2 plus of tan inverse b by a plus constant of integration. Eighth one, find integral of x square by root of x plus 5 dx. Okay. Now, numerator we have x square the denominator root of x minus x plus 5. 
it had better to say x plus 5 is equal to something t square root of t square is equal to easily we get t. So, now i is equal to integral x square by root of x plus 5 dx. Let us say x plus 5 is equal to t that implies x is equal to t minus 5. Now, d t becomes d x. Okay. Let us substitute integral x square means t minus 5 whole square root of sorry this is t square we get t square minus 5 whole square. So, this is t d t. Now, this is t square minus 5 whole square is t power 4 minus 10 t square plus 25 upon t dt. Let us separate the terms t cube 10 t plus 25 by t dt. Now, integral t cube dt 10 common t dt 25 common integral 1 by t dt t power 4 by 4 minus 10 t square by 2 25 log mod t. So, now this is t square is equal to x plus 5. This is x plus 5 whole square by 4 minus 5 t square. t square means x plus 5 plus 25 log mod that will be root of t plus 5, root of x plus 5 of times. So, x plus 5 whole square by 4 minus 5 of x plus 5 plus 25 by 2 log mod x plus 5 plus constant of integration. Some more additional examples. Evaluate integral of x square by root of 1 minus x square dx. Now, let us do it this one. i is equal to integral x square by root of 1 minus x square dx. Better using substitution, trigonometric substitution. Put x is equal to sin theta. Then dx by d theta is cos theta. So, dx is equal to cos theta d theta substituting integral this is sin square theta by root of 1 minus sin square theta into cos theta d theta, d theta. root of 1 minus sin square theta is cos theta. So, this is integral sin square theta by cos theta into cos theta d theta. These two gets cancelled. We have integral sin square theta d theta multiply 2 and divide by 2. So, 1 by 2 integral 2 sin square theta d theta. So, this is nothing but 1 minus cos 2 theta. So, 1 by 2 integral of 1 minus cos 2 theta d theta. So, now 
this is half times integral d theta minus integral cos 2 theta d theta of this is d theta minus sin 2 theta by differentiation of 2 theta is 2. What is the formula for sin 2 x? The formula for sin 2 x is 2 sin x cos x. So, sin 2 theta we can write 2 sin theta cos theta. So, this is half multiplied by theta minus 2 sin theta cos theta by 2. This 2 2 gets cancelled. We have half times theta minus sin theta and cos theta. But our answer should be in terms of x. So, as we have x is equal to sin theta, now we can write theta is equal to sin inverse x. We can substitute theta is equal to sin inverse x. But whereas cos theta is there, so that means cos theta is equal to we write root of 1 minus sin square theta, which is equal to root of 1 minus x square. Let us substitute this value, these values. So, half of sin inverse x minus x root of 1 minus x square plus constant of integration. 